Yeah, I think fighting is very connected to, to life and like how the universe gives you what you deserve, not what you want, and it's very honest. So in, in life you can run away from your problems and you can like find an easier path to make things easier for yourself, which is really just shortcutting yourself in the long run. And I think the same thing can happen in training for a fight and, and in an actual fight and competition. You can shorten your, yourself. And the truth is, it's gonna show. It's gonna. It's all gonna show at the end of the day. Fighting is the most real thing that is hands-on. You know, you're gonna train for this fight. How you train is gonna make a difference in how the fight happens. And then after the fight, it's gonna matter how your mind is. And all those things, there's no way around it. There's no like. There's no way you can fake those feelings. I have a fight in two months. So yeah, he's my. My man, the man with the camera. Did you fight a tiger? No. Stop! <laughs> I, I mean, no, no, it's, it's, it's a fight, you know, it's not like an exciting thing, it's a more of a tough thing to deal with. But it's worth it. It's like boxing, but you kick. You can kick and you can choke and you can go to the ground and you're like, there's like all, it's like anything you want to do, you can do. So it's like that movie, Never Back Down? Yeah, it's like that. It's called MMA, Mixed Martial Arts. When is it? When is it? When's my fight? Uh, New Year's Eve in Japan. Oh, in Japan? Yeah. Because you get paid and you have an experience and you have a... It's just a... I don't know, like you get through the... Nothing, nobody can take that away from you though, after you get done with the fight. put together some uh, editing stuff and then when we got it all ready we're gonna come in and show you. Alright, all right. but I'm already late for training, they're gonna get mad at me all for right. showing it late. Take care throughout the day. But like how like it's just a completely different perspective. I feel so dirty when I pitch it right. Yeah, I make you nervous how I get you right. Yeah, I think my home might be the preacher wife. Yeah, I mean my home might be the sneak attack. Are they mean to me? They're not mean to me, except for they want to beat me. Everybody's very nice to me, except for the guys who are not nice to me. And those guys, they get choked. <laughs> You're very nice. You're my friend. No, actually, is Jeremy nice to you? Is Jeremy nice to me? Yes, <laughs> Jeremy's nice to me. What I'm asking for. What I'm asking for. 
That's it. That's it. You're not going to hit me hard back, though, are you? Do you want to squash that? I don't like people punching my face. What? No, I like what? You want to get punched in the face? Otherwise, I would love to. You want to get punched in the face, dude? It's so fun. Colin, tell him. And I said, I said, what? Like it's an acquired taste. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, I would love to join you guys. It's an acquired taste. At first, it's it's hard to understand, but, <laughs> but after after a while, you start to get it. Like that. Green taste. <laughs> He's like, seriously? <laughs> seriously? Let me see that on Snapchat. I mean, I can feel it when I'm training for a fight. When my, when my body telling me to stop, and when my mind telling me to stop, and when it starts to, to give up. And those are the actual moments, which is just weeding out. You think I was gifted, like, I get, I get gifted like an injection. A Gracie injection. That now I'm a chap because I'm fixing Gracie stuff. And this injection, let me tell you, not real. I've been looking for that injection. They never made that one. Those points when you're training and it gets tough are made to stop a certain person. And then there's other limitations and then there's other places and then so I think for me it's product of my um, of my life and how I've been brought up to live and the lessons that I've learned. And then when you didn't lose and you win, it's like whoa. Okay, so then now you're the next fight, and I was in another fight. And I think it's an experience, you know, we go through this time and this experience where we're healthy and young, and you get to use your body to its limitations. But it's a time, it's a small time and it passes. I'm just looking to get these experiences out of the way while I can, while I'm healthy. I feel like it's time for me to break my body down. It's time for me to, to go through these, you know, just difficult situations and on all angles. Ready? Look at all the espressos I'm about to make. Ah, man, what am I doing? Take me out and play, uh, flip the game upside down from. It looks legit, but it's even tastes more legit. Oh, what a perfect fit. What a fit. Oh, shit, this looks complicated. This is what scares me. I never built one, but I tried an express. I made one. Roll over there. Where? Um, who's over here? It is such a good night to kiss. It is such a good night to kiss. It is such a good night to kiss. Kidding killer coffee machine or what? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Look at how is that? <laughs> <laughs> that shit is felonious, dude. Oh, it's <laughs> Got beans all over the floor. Fucking beans out. Now the coffee grinder is a fucking. Don't you have a coffee grinder? Well, mine's. That's very complex. Dude, that's not. We only got this. We only got enough for one more. Hey, that thing is like 30 different digital settings. This thing's already broken. Lid, ground bin, burr removal tool, and calibration tool. It doesn't make any sense. How about this? Isn't it, shouldn't this go in? <laughs> like, no, that's the calibrator. That's like All right, just let me okay. fucking freestyle this shit real quick. For oh, a damn. Time. He's getting a bust of Nine freestyle. seconds. That's you the one that with the alphabet on the left. And then tear. Choose a preset. No. <laughs> then you choose what you just do. I just put the more though. What does that mean? What the fuck? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> All right, who wants the first one? Ooh, uh, coffee beans are kind of weird though. Pretty weird. I can put a little bacon grease on there. It's the beans. The floor coffee. Mm -hmm. Tastes like, like, 
like the, the, the beans are strong, but that top one. No, it's because that, that bean is like a very Boom. <laughs> No, but I'm telling you, these beans that I bought, they were fucking... Cool, huh? <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro, I know espresso, bro. It's not espresso, it's espresso. <laughs> <laughs> I know the espresso, I was Yeah, I'm coming up, I think, towards the end of the week. And uh, I don't know, maybe stay there, maybe stay at an Airbnb or something. Or... Alright, we'll hit you guys up. Look, I sold you percent. It's not about me trying to break your heart. Not about me trying to hurt it. It's about me making sure the only people that stuck around me are the people that deserve it. I better do work. I kept my number. Hey, this time I came. This time I came to train. Yeah. Can you change it? Don't answer. I'm gonna get him real quick. Yeah. Even better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. I've been doing this animation for like five years now. It's a long time. I started fighting. No, I kind of chose teams to be with Nick and Nate and Gilbert and Jake. So then it's just been back and forth from Nate's, Nate's gym to here. So this is more wrestling, more like explosive workouts. And a certain type of training, it's a certain type of environment you're gonna get here. Hard training sessions and wrestling, and kickboxing. When you reach a certain level and you get to certain, these energies are gonna are, are gonna make you better. When you train with guys or when you choose the type of training that you're gonna do, you know, you choose like, okay, I'm gonna choose to be this kind of person. I'm gonna choose to be this kind of person. Okay, so what do I need? You leave there and you're like, fuck, dude. That got me better. See what happens? See what happens? All I can do is train. Go buy it. Everybody now has a great skill who fights me. What is it? Until they get killed. So Tokoro, he beat two Gracies, and then, then, then are you going for revenge? I'm like, dude, this is such bullshit. That was 10 years ago, you think I'm fighting for revenge for my uncle? That fought him two, 10 years ago? That was, yeah. I'm trying to just survive out here and win my fight and do the yeah, best bro, I can. I'm doing this for myself, bro. I'm challenging myself. Yeah. I'm beat your ass if you're in my way. I've been learning a lot from all my training partners. In a lot of different ways, and it's good. I look back, you know, just talking about how five years I've been starting to MMA, and I look back at who I was five years ago. Uh, I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of all the shit I went through, the suffering and training and not giving up. And it's not even about the success that I have with training and actually fighting, but just getting through it. Think you should I mean I really think you should yeah. oh.